Derbyshire. It's very windy, it's very cold, but it's amazing to have that open. Look at all the kids' show boats, four bedrooms. Now it's quite a good looking four bedroom house, as you can see. It's got its own integral garage. It's quite a traditional looking build as well. Without further ado, let's go and take a look around. Hello. Hello, welcome to Keep Moat Homes. Hello. And the development is Mill Farm. Mill Farm. And we're in Tibshelf yes. in Derbyshire. And this is the Orchid. Orchid. Four bed, yes. All right, okay. Excuse me. Oh. I just nearly got blown away by Storm Brian. I tell you what, this, this house type would work in, in the Black Country, you know. Would it? Yeah. Why is that? Because it's an orchid. Orchid, that's oh, what they say. Gosh. That's what they say. Orchid. Right, anyway, enough of the um, whimsical nonsense. Um, we are in this house. Yeah. One, one to do today, isn't there? And we haven't got a plan, unfortunately. The, uh, the salesman has just told us that. Well, you'll provide all the details yeah, of me. Yeah. Yes. Well, it's a cute looking house from the outside, isn't it? It is, it is. So let's strip that it down and start having a look, look around. Oh, that's not. But that is. The integral the garage. garage. Yes. Right then, so we've got a dining room. It's nice to actually have an access to the garage from the house, isn't it? Dining room at the front. Yeah. Do you know we're seeing a lot of these kind of retro looking dining tables? Yeah. I a... remember something like this from the uh, the seventies. Right. Big cupboard under the stairs there. Right. You can smell the paint in there. Very nice, isn't it? Nice window to the front there. Yeah. That? A lot of sunshine today, even though it is absolutely blowing a game. Right, I've got a door here. Okay. She downstairs. Yeah. Crew. Up there. Not much we can say about it, but it's you know adequate. Well, it's under the stairs and it's internal. And the fact is, under the stairs, there's enough room to stand up and yeah. you know do what you've got to do. Okay, let's go to the orange. So this is at the back of the house. At the rear, Ooh, very nice. I'm liking the orange accent. Very nice. Seems to be a lot now. It's funny, quite, quite typically a colour of the autumn, isn't it? And I've seen a lot of show homes with the oranges in just lately. So we can't tell you how many houses are on this development at the moment. We will get all that information as we pop back through. Yeah. There was actually some customers with the uh, sales negotiator so we didn't, uh, we didn't interrupt did we? Yeah I, I mean what do we know really about Keep Moat? I mean Keep Moat is, is a really really bright brand isn't it? It's, they build really really a very good regeneration yeah. specialists yeah, as well. They, they take on a lot of the sites that no one will take on so they build a, they've got a great portfolio of house types. So this house, I think, is just aimed at a family, isn't it? Just yeah. a small, you know, yeah. It's not the la a large four bed, but it's a, you know. Well, it's a, it's a good sized family home, yeah. isn't it? If you're moving up from a three. But you haven't necessarily got to have a family to live in it. Yeah. So you've got this square landing, actually, which is a big space, isn't it? Right. And you've got a 
And do you know what? We've got, yeah, we've got four, three double bedrooms and a slightly smaller bedroom. Right, we'll start in this bedroom. Thank you. So it's a double bedroom, isn't it? Window to the front of the house. That is the front, isn't it? Yep. Yes. And fitted wardrobes. As I said, I'll put all the dimensions in the uh, description box down below. It seems to be happening a lot lately where we haven't got a plan, yeah. unfortunately. Okay, so we've got another bedroom here, which I would say is definitely a single bedroom, isn't it? It is weird. Though, to, to be honest with you, actually naming rooms are irrelevant really, aren't they? Because yeah. A lot, you know, that means nothing to a customer, does it? You I know? suppose what it helps the viewers do is if, if they're buying that house, they might have a copy of that plan yeah. so they can look at it and they know which room yeah. we're in. At least that's how I rationalise it. If, if you viewers, um, use that information for some other purpose, please let us know. Obviously, as you're watching this, we're overlaying the we're overlaying yeah. the actual rooms. And also, because we give the dimensions. They yeah. need to know which room those dimensions are for. So it's useful to know which room we're in. But unfortunately we don't. But oh, yes. Right, so main bathroom. It's got its own window. I'll open this door here. It's nice, it's got it's quite a colour moody in here. It's got a cupboard. That could be your airing cupboard. It's yeah. useful, isn't it? Yeah. Put some shelves in there, some it's, towels. Uh, it's the fan in here that we can hear. No stuff in there. Yeah. I mean, my guess would be the child's room would be bedroom four. That would be bedroom three. This would be bedroom two that we're about to go in. So you're saying. And next door would be bedroom So you're saying one. four? Yes. Three. Yes. Two. This one would say one. Two. Yeah. Yeah. Lose it. I'm not hard to wear that. Just either. based on our experience. Yeah. That's that's uh, kind of where I'm at. Right. I've got to. I'm sorry, but they've left this for me, haven't they? How does that look? <laughs> Lovely. Right. So, what do we know about tip shelf? Well, it's, I tell you what, it's right next to the motorway. You can't ask for better access to the motorway. Okay. It's a lovely yes. little village, isn't it? Yeah. It's just, we've been through it and it's quite taint, quite quaint, isn't it? It's got a, a great big senior school, actually. Yeah. Almost across the road from here, so very well located. It's got various shops and amenities. I'll take you a little look at, the, uh, at, the, at some of the houses and the, how everything works at the back. If you can see. Anyway, so back to this room. Double bed. Nice bedding. I like that. Good sized room, though. Big pieces of furniture yeah. either side of the bed. That's the book. Is that a diary? Room. Yeah, it's just a, a notebook. <coughs> okay, then. And then, last but not least, I think this is bedroom one. Did we open that door we there? We didn't, but we will. Ah, okay, we need to. Yeah, I would say this is the master. And it's got an ensuite, hasn't it? Let me open that door while you're there. There we go. I like the interior design. I think it's very nice with space. I think you always get a very nice interior design with, yeah. with the keep note. Very colourful. Accessories, right? Like that very much. So I would say that's a double bed, but there's plenty of room for a much bigger bed if you've got one, because there's plenty of space either side. It's quite feels quite a spacious bedroom, just yeah. like the one next door. So they've got fitted wardrobes here as well, mirrored, so that they disappear. Lovely, lovely feature. But actually, lots of room to walk around the bed. It's a good-sized bedroom. 
and quite a low windowsill yeah. on the window as well, so you've got a lot of light. Very nice, particularly like this bedroom. Right, and there was a door on the landing, yeah? Let's have a look. Yeah, oh, another the cupboard. Stairs cupboard. Yeah. 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 There are plenty of cupboards in this house. Okay. Right. Well, what do you think, Emma? I think it's a nice house. Oh, I've got, I've got my fleece on today. It's a bit cold. It's it's really cold. But Storm Brian is knocking around, mm -hmm. isn't he? Anyway, lovely house by Gate Mode, isn't it? Yeah, very nice. There are two showrooms on this development. Um, the other is actually a stone, but stone house. But they've integrated the sales centre into it, so we don't really like doing those, do we? Because you can't really get a proper feel of a house. No, really. we don't think it gives you guys the best viewing experience, no, really. And well, also, there are lots of people in the sales yeah, centre, so it. it's not always great. But anyway, so we've brought you this one, which is the Orchid, a, four beds, a, and a mill all, farm. All the details will be in the box down below, so don't forget yeah. to have a look yeah. at that. And this, this, and and this, this house type is available on a lot of different yeah, keep sites up and down the country. Um, I think it is one of their standard portfolio house types. Mm -hmm. um, I uh, and. I'd like you yeah, if you like join our Facebook page and um, like the page and you'll get lots of updates of where we are what we're doing some sneaky pictures that we like to add on there yeah and also leave us a review find you know tell us why you like showrooms online yeah but we'll catch you on our next video thanks for watching bye for now <laughs>